times, right? So let's deal a little bit more with this conflict between like the nationalists, right, and the globalists, right? So the nationalists are the white folks here in the United States, the so-called, uh, you know, uh, patriots, white nationalists, of course, um, who are mainly concerned with uh, conserving the traditional values of this country, right? This country being essentially a white nation uh, built uh, on the backs of enslaved peoples and dispossessed peoples, right? Maintaining this as what it is, is what the patriots want. They want to hold on also to their traditional values, which we as black people, a lot of us want to hold on to as well. And by traditional values, I mean values around, you know, how we understand, uh, you know, things like gender and sexuality and all that stuff. Right. So like, I, I, I just, I, I want you to understand that there are points of, of overlap, right. But we don't want to jump out there and get into the middle of their shit. I'm just trying to lay out kind of like, or simplify the conflict that we are seeing happening here. Right. So you have the nationalists that want, a uh, uh, local government. They don't want to be ruled over by some, you know, so-called one world government. You know what I mean? That, that is not local to them. Um, they want borders to be kept in place, right? They want, they don't want America uh, interfering in other nations like around the world. But what the nationalists don't understand is that America is an empire. So there's definitely some confusion and some ignorance on their side, but I just want you to understand what's happening. Then the globalists on the other side are more for one world government. You know, they're, these are the folks who are definitely going to be pushing, you know, your world health organizations, your, you know, your world banks, your international monetary fund, your UN, right? They want the global systems of governments and the global institutions to have more control, um, right? So state sovereignty is not something that the globalists like really uh, care for because in order to operate in this new interconnected world that we exist in uh, nations are going to have to forgo some of their rights. Nations are going to have to forgo some of their sovereignty so that the system, this global system can work and effectuate itself uh, more appropriately. Right? So this is kind of like this conflict that you have between like the nationalists and then on the right hand, you have the globalists. Now, that's the top level that you have, right? Top level, the 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 surface level, right? I wish I, I have to I have to. Uh, uh, Mama Marimba has a good framework where she talks about uh, like the Jerry So and the So E, right? The different uh, 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 levels of analysis that we see, like when we're looking at the thing, right. You know, on the top at the level, and then like having a complete, like full holistic understanding of a thing. Right. So that's basically the top level, right. When we talk about like the, the nationalist versus the globalist, then you go a level down and that same conflict plays out. And you, you see now, and you have the so-called, just uh, Anglo-Saxon, like white Europeans. And then on the other side, you have the, what they refer to as the European Jews, right? So the white nationalists consider the globalists really to be made up of the European Jews. So they see it's a conflict between the two and they look at the globalists or the so-called European Jew as controlling, you know, the minorities and using us as pawns in the fight to dispossess the nationalists, right? So that's the under the surface, right? So on the top of the surface, you'll see, you know, folks like Tucker, Tucker Carlson and other, uh, uh, you know, prominent white nationalist voices or so-called U.S. patriots that speak against globalism, right? And you might not get the connotations, but under the surface, there's also that, that ethnic tension there, right? There's the Anglo-Saxon that sees the 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 white the european jew the white your so this is two white groups right the globalists the nationalists the nationalists the white anglo-saxon the globalists the white european jew are at odds at conflict with one another for like what the future of power will be and a lot of us get caught in the middle of this situation between them two and we see one is good and one is bad or one is bad and one is good. And I'm just trying to give you a view as to what's happened because it's important for us to at least start there 
and understanding at some level this conflict between the nationalists and the globalists, because this is a very, very real thing. And the nationalists, the aggression that you are seeing is not going to go away because the nationalists feel as though the globalists have all of the reins of power. They control all of the media. Uh, they control all of the banking. Uh, they control all of the national institutions, World Bank, IMF, uh, World Health Organization, right? Um, and then even locally, and by locally, I mean like on a, on, a, on a national level, right, versus a global level. Even here locally, right, they, you know, you have the technocracy. So you have the political parties working with the technology companies to maintain or control the discourse and the dialogue and paint one group as, you know, backwards and enemies and all this stuff. So it's a, it's a very interesting uh, situation that is happening here. So I just want, I want us to understand that. And I don't want us to lose sight of that because there are many levels to this thing like this is the this is a this is a 5d chessboard that's happening and a lot of us even on this 5d chessboard we're still pawns right so i want us to be able to back up don't be a pawn in their game don't get confused as to what's happening like don't be out here looking christmas addicts because this is a very very real situation